Let's start with the permutations for President John Dramani Mahama. There are 69 constituencies to go with a registered voter population we know now of 3,827,081. Now, at the current average turnout of 68%, this translates into 2,652,000. 483 votes. Now, the current provisional valid votes cast is 7,988,676. Now, when you add it to the expected number of votes from the 69 constituencies, this comes to 10,545,267 votes. Therefore, 50% plus 1 comes to 5,272,633. Now, at 206 constituencies, as Raymond just told us, President John Dramani Mahama is at 3,710,702 votes. For President Mahama to reach 5.3 million, he needs 1,598,355 votes. On average, he is capturing around 46%. On average, he's capturing 46% of the provisional valid votes. Now, assuming President Muhammad does 10% better than he's currently doing at 46%, he has done across the remaining 69 undeclared constituencies, he will achieve an additional 1,412,346, which is below 1,598,355 required to make 50% plus one. What about the MPP presidential candidate, Nanado Danko Akufado? Now, same permutations apply, but with different outcomes. There are 69 constituencies to go with a registered voter population, as we said already, of 3,827,081. Now, at the current average turnout of 68%, this translates into 2,652,483 votes. Now, the current provisional valid votes cast is 7,988,676. When added to the expected number of votes from the 69 constituencies, this comes to 10,545,267 votes. Therefore, 50% plus 1 comes to 5,272,000 633. Now, at 206 constituencies, Nanado is at 4,213,710 votes. Now, for Nanado Nakwa Kufado to reach 5.3 million, he needs 1,117,663 votes. Now, assuming Nanado Dankwa Kufado does 10% lower than his current 52.17% he has done across the remaining 69 undeclared constituencies. He will achieve additional 1,210,716, which is 93,053 more than 50% plus one. What does this mean? We therefore project it is almost statistically impossible for President John Dramani Mahama to achieve 50% plus one. Our projection is that Nana Adodankwa Kufado will win the 2016 presidential election.